Hello, uh, this video is going to show how to input the binomial probability equation and the Poisson probability equation into a calculator. So I'm going to use this TI-89 emulator. I put the link to that on Blackboard. So we've already seen this equation worked out, uh, this example worked out on the lecture, so I'm not going to go through that again, but what I want to show you is how to specifically input it into the calculator. You may notice I use little tails under the P. Uh, that's just so I can keep straight uppercase P and lowercase P because um, it gets confusing. So the first thing we want to be able to do is do this factorial, right? Five factorial. So you can either look up factorial tables, and those are widely available on the internet. You can multiply it out yourself or the calculator can do it for you. So to do let's say 5 factorial we would put in 5 on this 89 we would do second uh, go to the math option pick number 7 and then pick number 1 on that list and so that gives us the answer 5 factorial is 120. So if you have a, a graphing calculator like this you can incorporate the whole equation and do it at once. And if you don't have a graphing calculator, I don't recommend trying to do it all in one line because it's hard to see exactly what you're doing. But if you do, it can be quite useful. So we'll, we'll show this as one line. So we'll do 5 factorial. Go through this process again. 7, 1. And then we're going to divide that by the quantity, the whole, the whole denominator. So it's going to be 4 factorial. times the quantity 5 minus 4 and the factorial of that. Alright, and then close that parentheses and then we're going to multiply all of that by uh, 0.5, 0 0.5 raised to the fourth power times the quantity uh, 1 minus 0 0.5 to the quantity 5 minus 4 and if I did that right that is the correct number of parentheses which gets us uh, that I get 15.6 she may have round that to 16 unless I did something incorrect so I can look up here and see I can scroll over to see if what I'm actually operating on is correct and that looks like uh, what we're trying to do. So then uh, for the Poisson probability we, we need to be able to use this exponential term and so on this type of calculator that exponential is uh, e to the x right so it's shown right here. So for this, we are looking at the numerator is e raised to the negative 6.6 .6 power uh, times 6.6 .6 raised to the second power, and then all of that divided by 2 factorial. And that gets us our uh, 0 0.03 or 0.029629, depending on how many decimal places you want to carry. Usually you don't carry too many decimal places. Um, so I hope you found this useful, and have a good day.